Hello and welcome back to Skyrim. We're gonna see if we can take out Gallus with Carlia. And end this once and for all, get our revenge. But first, Sharda Grove discovered. Uh oh, bees. Bears? Sure. The heck are you? Spriggan Earth Mother. Oh, you're a special Spriggan. Okay, not too much in here. Just a little uh, bear cave. With a spriggan and a wolf, and they were all fighting. Right now I am heading to... Erkenthand. To meet Carlia and Brynjolf. And here we got a, uh, probably a troll or a giant, uh, camp. Spiders. I suppose we could go to uh, say hi to the giants. Hello. They're not too deadly anymore. Um, let's grab your soul. Get away from me. Tumble Arc Pass. Oh, hello. There are trolls out here. Nice of you to join us. Alright, let's be on our way. There it is. Garundum ore seems to be the most rare type of ore besides uh, ebony. I think we can use that for locks for our house. So I will take it. And it. Where's Carlia?
I think this is where we were supposed to meet them. Yet this place is filled with bandits. I guess maybe they snuck in. Ow. Oh, he dodged my fireball. Well done. But I couldn't save you. Okay, I have been here before. I remember this place. Let me just make sure here. Reckon and yep. Yeah, Mercer's trying to steal the eyes the eye of Falmer. We're trying to get the skeleton key from him. Yeah, I was here before. Um It's possible there's something Ah, here we go. There's uh, some kind of mechanism here in here that I couldn't activate before. In some of these dwarven ruins, there are some things that I was never able to interact with. Dragon plate, insulated cuirass. Wow. Mine. These bandit chiefs have great stuff on them. Companion? She's not following me. I want her to carry my armor. Alright, where is Carlia? Okay, they killed the bandits inside, so yeah, I guess they snuck in undetected. She left the chest for me, though. That was nice of her. Oh, they didn't stand a chance. So many dead bandits. How far in is Carlia? Oh, she's way in there. Okay. 
thought she was going to wait for me at the entrance. Got little crossbows. That's cute. I sure could use a companion right about now. Hearing odd noises over there. Uh, Master Gate, how would I get up there? Oh, there we go. Knocking myself off. Okay, that didn't work. Ah, there we go. I guess that's how I was supposed to get up there the proper way. Okay, that goes to the Grand Cavern. Yep, that's where I need to go. Oh, they made it all the way down here. Wow. There you are. Mercer's been here. I hope we aren't too late. Sorry, I didn't bring my armor. I changed out of my uh, Nightingale armor. Brynjolf and I found them like that. Mercer's doing. Oh, Mercer killed him. We have to catch up to him before it's too late. I'm ready. Let's go. We should tread carefully. I wouldn't be surprised if he's left behind a few surprises for us. So he's expecting us. Cool. The eyes would go a long way in helping get the guild back on its feet. You think Mercer knows we're here? The last seems to think old Mercer is pulling a fast one on us, leading us here and letting the dwarven constructs wear us down. I've learned to trust her lead at this point. After all, we Nightingales need to stick together, eh? Absolutely. 
We've been nightingales for like 15 minutes. Now we're all, we're all like family. Uh, what are the eyes of the Falmer? A few years before Mercer murdered Gallus, the guild took in a thief who specialized in dwarven antiquities. The thief had broken into a nobleman's home somewhere in Windhelm, made off with a small figurine of a snow elf with crystalline eyes. A snow elf? Aye. That's what the Falmer were known as long ago, before they became the blind monstrosities they are today. When Gallus took one look at this statue, he knew it was something special. He took it right up to Enther at the College of Winterhold. Didn't take long for Enther to find a book in the college's library that told of Urkenthat and a great statue with gemmed eyes within. So the eyes of the Falmer are gems? Not just ordinary gems. They are said to be flawlessly cut and as big as a man's head. Can you imagine how much they're worth? Gallus and Mercer spent the better part of a month infiltrating Urkenthat, but the dwarves had protected the place far too well. There were just too many obstacles blocking the way. The plans were shelved, and the rest is history. Until next we meet, lad. Alright, let's grab him. Oh, watch out for the... Spike trap. Spike on our ball. Ingot, ingot, amethyst, sapphire, ingot, and Dwemer metal. I have a lot of carrying capacity now. I, I put away all of my uh, jewelry that I wasn't using. It really adds up a lot. What's that? I see Falmer. Oh, that's Mercer. Damn it. There's no way through. Behind you, Falmer. Hang on a minute. He wants us to follow. Ooh, that's a good screenshot. There we go. Well, if he wants us to follow, we'll follow him. Let's go. Oh, Brynjolf's talking. Okay. I don't want to get too far ahead. Might miss some dialogue. No mercy for the Uh, is that a ballista? Fire. Well, that didn't do much. I think the Falmer down there saw us. Where'd he go? I saw him running. Yeah, it was aimed at some Falmer standing guard there, but he ran away. Orcish plate gauntlets. Hmm. The downside of the dragon scale armor is it 
I... I don't really like the look of it that much. Oh god, what the... Alright, who did that? Where are you? I mean, it looks fine, but I think I prefer, like, orc or dwarven armor. I like to use those. There you are. Who's shooting me? Is that you? Yeah, that looks cool. Alright, anyway. I think we have uh, another lever to... pull on this side. That should do it. I should open the door. Oh god. Watch out for that. I just pick up. Well, I guess the dragon plate armor looks pretty cool. I don't like the weird shoulder pads though. Here, but I don't know. Oh no, what did I just pick up? I don't know what I just picked up. Is that a weapon? No. Palmer bow. Okay. Oh, I gotta hit both of these switches. In a timely manner. Oh. go that worked come on guys we made it what did I step on oh bear trap Looks like we can the least the dangerous trap in all of Skyrim Do what now? I have a choice, he said. Um. Now I'm guessing he was giving me an option of uh, the sneaky route or the fight everything, just plow my way through route. We'll take the, uh, destructive approach. Oh boy.
This place is gonna collapse. Goes Brynjolf. Okay, that passage is blocked. Up here, everyone. Silly Mercer. Think I'm gonna be fooled by a bear trap. Think I won't be able to see it. It's empty. Mercer was here. Come on. Come on. There we go. Not the first one I've killed. Killed many of them. Not scared. Let's switch to Fire Breath. Sorry, Brynjolf. Ah, Carlyle, help. Wow, they took him down. Brynjolf and Carlia. Couldn't handle three Falmer. I picked up something I couldn't carry. I think that was it. Alright. Like uh oh. It's alive. Not so tough. I gotta drop something. Freaked out there for a moment. Oh god. They've got rats.
Okay, we gotta get up there. Yeah, we're being shot at. That's okay. Oh, they got spiders. Ow. Oh god, I picked up one Falmer ear. And that's enough to... put me over. Uh, Lost Legends, I don't need that one. A lot of these books I need to keep. Ah, uh, the Thief's Journal. I can... No, I can't drop that. Vigilance Report. Oh, yeah. I can drop that. That's an old thing. Okay. Okay, that way? Or that way? This is where we saw Mercer. We must be getting close. Well, let's have a look up here first. Is this just a way out? Oh, it doesn't actually lead up there. That's where we came through. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. We came in through here. Saw Mer Mercer through the... The fence there. The bars. I can't pick up. What a shame. Okay, what do we got here? Traps, and we got a chair. What's the, what, what, what's the purpose of the chair? Not a very a good view. I guess if you want to view the executions, but wouldn't the chair be then over here? This looks like a execution chamber of some kind. Yeah, we got torture devices. Thief's last words. Although these might not be Dwemer torture devices. Thief's last words. Nobody thought they were real, but I've seen them. The eyes of the snow elves. The dwarves thought they took them from the Falmer. But they themselves were fooled. A statue built in secret by the slaves. The eyes burn into you, and I see them even now. Sarafa escaped through the collapsing tunnel, but he'll never escape what we've seen. Men will never believe him, and he'll be driven mad by the knowledge that he'll never see them again. But I may yet see them again before I die. Well, she seems to imply that this... Uh, these are dwarf, uh, dwarven... Torture devices. I mean, it's obviously a torture chamber. You got the blades here and all these tools and everything, but I figured maybe these racks were set up 
much more recently. Doesn't look like it. Ah. Oh, there's a lot of them. Look at all those souls. Beautiful. Human heart, I'll take that. Never know when you're gonna need it. Can't see a thing in here. Nothing up here, okay. So, yeah, it looks like we have to go. Through here. Spider eggs. I don't want to go in there. Gross. God, not you. Not the hunters. Hunters are the worst. I'll take the antenna. Oh, great. my follower. I can't dump all my Dwemer medals onto her. Okay, this might be a point of no return. Looks like we gotta drop down. Alright, everyone. Hey, good job. You too, Brynjolf. I believe in you. Nothing's get by me. 
Calm down that bench. See if you can... Carlia, when will you learn you can't get the drop on me? Oh boy. Well, he's got the eye. When Brynjolf brought you before me, I could feel a sudden shift in the wind. And at that moment, I knew it would end with one of us at the end of a blade. Give me the key, Mercer. What's Carlia been filling your head with? Tales of thieves with honor? Oaths ripe with falsehoods and broken promises? Nocturnal doesn't care about you, the key, or anything having to do with the guild. The blazes with Nocturnal, I'm here for the eyes. Wait a moment. Do I detect a hint of genuine avarice from this noble thief? Perhaps Carlia and Brynjolf misjudged you and your true nature is no different than my own. The difference is I still have honor. It's clear you'll never see the skeleton key as I do, as an instrument of limitless wealth. Instead, you've chosen to fall over your own foolish code. If anyone falls, it'll be you. Then the die is cast, and once again my blade will taste nightingale blood. Carlyle, I'll deal with you after I rid myself of your my 3v1. Where'd you go? Oh, he's invisible. I see him. They're fighting. It's just me. But my magic is too powerful. Hey, come back here. Okay. Um... Skeleton key. That is a nice looking key. I'll take it. Eye of the Falmer. Mine. Right Eye of the Falmer. Sapphire. Alright, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna have to drop one of these, um... Solid Dwemer medals, because I want this stuff. Dwarven Sword of Devouring, I want that. I might be able to... Uh, disenchant it. Not sure. I have the Skeleton Key. Oh, it's flooding. I have an idea. Uh... I don't really, but... Okay, no underwater passages. Maybe through the... A pipe. I'll have to wait for the water to raise up a bit. I think we found the way out. We gotta climb out. Don't get stuck. This place is coming down. Let's get out of here. Ah. Uh, is the water ri level rising still? I think it's done. 
Rinyolf, good luck to you. Sorry, lad. I've got important things to do. We'll speak another time. Oh, okay. Well, bye then. Um. Sorry, lad. I've got important things to do. We'll speak another time. Nice of you to join me and Carlia on this mission. Twenty-five years in exile, just like that. It's done. All that remains is to ensure the safe return of the skeleton key. Sounds like it'll be a simple task. It's not that simple. And I'm proud to call it. When the skeleton key was stolen from the Twilight Sepulchre, our access to the inner sanctum was removed. The only way to bring it back would be through the Pilgrim's Path. I take it you never used the Pilgrim's Path? It wasn't created for the Nightingales. It was created to test those who wish to serve Nocturnal in other ways. As a consequence, I have no knowledge of what you'll be facing. Then we'd best get started. Brynjolf is needed back at the Thieves' Guild to keep order while you're away. And I... I can't bear to face Nocturnal after my failure to protect the key. Shame on you. I'm afraid you'll have to face the end of your journey alone. Not alone. I have a follower. Don't worry, I'll return the key. Take this with you. I'm not certain if it will help within the walls of the sepulchre, but I certainly don't need it as much as you. I've had this bow almost my entire life, and it's never let me down. I hope it brings you the same luck. Nightingale bow. I don't understand why you won't come with me. Been a nightingale for a very long time. I sold my allegiance to Nocturnal in exchange for many profitable years of thieving. Falling in love with Gallus was wrong. It was a distraction that allowed the sepulchre to be desecrated, and it likely cost him his life. Until the key is returned, I will never set foot inside that place again. Okay, tell me about the conduit inside the sepulchre. The conduit to Nocturnal's realm, the realm, the twilight sepulchre. Ah, dang it. Constructed Skip and dialogue again. In order to shield it from those who would exploit its power. It's through this conduit that we're given Nocturnal's greatest gift, our luck. What she gains in return is a complete mystery. Okay, tell me about agent about the agent of strife. This agent of strife can send forth a tendril of pure darkness into the heart of another, causing great injury to them. At the same time, this tether will bolster the agent's own life force, making him stronger. Okay, I think these are um when we get to the sepulcher, we'll have a choice of which power do we want. Tell me about the agent of stealth. I want that one. On moonlit nights or in darkened rooms, this agent literally becomes invisible. Tell me about the agent of subterfuge. The agent of subterfuge utilizes shadow to cloud the judgment of those around him. By weaving the darkness to their will, to follow this agent can manipulate hunter. others into but fighting my for the girl for a limited time. He never complained. Yeah, I think agent of stealth will be the one I want. Although it would be it would be fun to play as um like another type of mage that um specializes in uh, illusions and stuff like that. Get creatures to fight each other instead of destruction magic. Just get them to fight each other with frenzy spells, things like that. That might be fun to try sometime. What's the story with the pilgrim's path? Even though Nocturnal doesn't desire worship in the traditional sense Twilight Sepulchre propagated a small group of priests. Of course, they never come into direct contact with Nocturnal, but they insisted they had her favor. As part of their duties, the priests created all sorts of baseless rituals and ceremonies, all on Nocturnal's behalf. This didn't interfere with the Nightingales? These priests weren't a threat to the Skeleton Key, or the conduit to Nocturnal's realm, so they were tolerated. One of their ceremonies involved the Pilgrim's Path, a so-called test of worthiness. If a Pilgrim was able to complete the path, it was said that they would live forever in twilight. What that means is anyone's guess. Uh, that di dialogue did not match what was on the screen, but that's okay. 
All right. So now on to this pilgrim's path. I'm going to end it here. I'm slow as hell. I'm going to have to drop some stuff again. Um, oh, nice. Mine. I'm itching for a or you can carry stuff for me. I can carry a good bit of gear. All right. Well, we killed Gallus. Avenged, not Gallus, we killed Mercer. Avenged uh, Gallus' death. And, um... We should be able to finish this up pretty soon. Alright, I'll see you next time. Thank you for watching.